Well, Democratic Indiana Attorney General candidate Jonathan Weinzapple says that he is for legalizing marijuana in the Hoosier state. Marijuana is legal in two of Indiana's neighboring states, Illinois and Michigan. Weinzapple says that he wants marijuana to be legalized and regulated for adult Indiana residents. He says this would generate millions of dollars, which could be used for public education while also allowing patients to use marijuana for medical purposes. If you think about veterans who are taking it to treat PTSD or people with a terminal illness that are taking it to relieve their, their pain, why would these folks be threatened with jail time for possession or use of marijuana? It makes zero sense. Republican Todd Rokita does not support legalization. He backs a current state law allowing a judge to issue a conditional discharge for first-time small marijuana possession offenses. And the three candidates for governor do not agree on the issue of decriminalizing or legalizing marijuana. Libertarian candidate Donald Rainwater says it should be completely legalized for recreational use. Democrat Dr. Woody Myers says it should be decriminalized for simple possession and legalized for medical use. Governor Holcomb does not support changing marijuana laws. The candidates will take part in their final gubernatorial debate, and you can see it on CBS4Indy.com tomorrow night at 7 p.m.